All right, we're going to do this together. We're doing it together. I just want whatever markings you have to mark, mark up. I'm not going to let just feed you to the wolves and say good luck. All right, we ready. Everyone's got it marked up, ready to roll. First, let's look at the proof statement. Let's look at the proof statement. TD congruent to RO. I need to get TD congruent to RO. Uh, I hopefully we are at the point in this unit where we know that will not happen until what's congruent first? Triangles. So as a class, we need to make a decision what two triangles do we need want to prove congruent? Because we could actually do two pair here and be okay. Okay, we could do two pairs. So can we, as a class, make a decision what two triangles we're going to try to prove congruent to get TD and RO? Because it could be both, either, it could be two pair up here. Anybody want to make a decision for us? Gage, go ahead. ROE, TDI. ROE. All right, so is everyone all right with those two? All right, we're good there. I could, yes, we could have also said the other two on the left and the right there was that TDE and IOR, it looks like. Okay, we could have proved those, but those are fine with me. Uh, all right, let's see, what do I already have in those? I have a pair of sides, right? Yes, everyone, I have a pair of sides in TI and ER. So I have a pair of sides already right here. And what are you about to tell me about the right angle? So I have another pair. All right angles are congruent. You don't need to tell me the right angles because I gave it to you in the givens. So angle TDI is congruent to angle ROE. All right angles congruent. Oh, there's a pair of angles too. I don't know. Am I overblowing this? I already... You already know two out of three, and we're already on step three. Mm, I, I got two out of three, man. Yeah? yeah, two out of three. I only need to find one more pair. What am I telling? What am I? What am I doing? To telling you guys, this is the toughest proofs we'll do all year. I got two out of three already. Are we ready for that third pair? Are we ready for the third pair? And this is where some of you guys got stuck yesterday, right? This is where you had the trouble in your partners. Where is this darn third pair? Let me know if you see it. Let me see it. Let me know when you get there. Do not make up stuff that's not there. Okay, please do not add in words that are not there. All right, I'm going to stop. Stop, you guys. I could let you go the whole period. No one's going to tell me a third pair because they don't exist right now. At this point in the proof, a third pair of congruent parts does not exist. You're never going to find them. You can't tell me these two sides. You can't tell me these two angles. It's not going to happen. So what do I just give up and say impossible? Absolutely not. But at this point in the proof, I don't have a third pair. So what I need you to do today, and this is why it's going to become tougher, is stop looking at those triangles. Find a new pair that you could possibly prove congruent right now. All right, so it's I, I, guys, I get it. I need to prove those two triangles Gage gave me. It's not going to happen right now, but I will get back to it. I will get back to it. I can't do it right now. At step three in this proof, I cannot prove those triangles congruent because I can't find a third pair. But look in your, with your partner right now. Is there a pair of triangles that I could prove congruent? 
Pretty quick. Pretty quick. Is there a pair? Look at all the information I've given you now. Is there a pair of triangles up here that can be proven congruent? Any anybody finding a pair so we can move on? Fells, what do you what do you have? What what are the two triangles? Correct. Everyone's the two big ones that are right on top of each other. T E I and R I E. But before I do that, because I only have two pairs of sides congruent. Where's my third pair going to come from? The reflexive side, EI. Good. So I'm going to say EI, congruent to EI, reflexive. And now that'll get triangle ETI, congruent to triangle. Let's see if I go ETI, RIE. Yeah, RIE. What's the method? Side, side, side. Okay, but why, why, why is he asking me to do that? Just to make my proof longer? Right? Why would, what is it? I'm stuck, so I'm just going to make myself look a little smarter, maybe get some partial credit. No, no. This is why I wanted you to find another pair of triangles. Use the triangles we just found congruent by side, side, side. Inside those, they have a pair of corresponding parts that are also in these triangles, and that'll become my third pair that I needed. Let me say that again. Look at these two triangles we just proved congruent by side, side, side. They have a pair of corresponding parts in common that I'll need to prove these two triangles congruent. Can you find the pair of corresponding angles or sides that these two triangles have that these two also would have? And that's going to be my missing third pair. Talk it over in your group. Where's that missing third pair? All right, let's talk back here. Anybody find a pair of angles or sides that are located not only in these two triangles, but also in these two, that will become my third pair, Violet. Um, angle TID, everyone look at that angle. And angle, how'd you name the other one, Violet? Uh, OER. -E everyone see those? They're in this SSS triangles, and they're in the two triangles I needed. And ready? What do I know about those two angles if they're in these two triangles I just proved congruent? Those angles are also congruent by CPCTC. There they are, right there. And everyone see? That was my missing pair I needed at the beginning when I got stuck. That was my missing pair. There is the other A. There it is. See how that worked? So now I have enough to say the original triangles I wanted, and triangle TDI is congruent to, let's see, if I go TDI, kids, I got to go what? ROE? ROE? And what method? I got two A's and an S. So it looks like you guys got to figure out if that S is in between or not, huh? Cover up one of the triangles if it helps. See if the side's in between. Kara, is it in between? It's not in between. So what method do I need? Angle, angle, side. Good. Angle, angle, side. And now, finally, TD is congruent to RO, CPCTC.
that's how these proofs are going to go today, where you'll probably have two out of the three pair you guys need in a tri two triangles, but that third pair is not coming anywhere. So you need to prove another set of triangles congruent to get that third pair. All right, so that's why I think these are the toughest, tough as they come. All right, you're going to be missing a third pair, and the third pair is going to actually come from another set of triangles. Questions on this one? We're going to do one more together before I let you go on the third one on your own. Anything here on this one? All right, let's take a peek at the next one. Again, nothing. 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 Stop just putting your head down and going to the next problem. All right, enjoy that we just finished one and maybe look at the slide transition when it comes up. Alright, I think we're good. No, no, I think you can limit the I think like the stress to like limit the amount. So not genie. Nobody's listening. Zach, that is not good. Yeah, person. Guys, you they all go one way. Okay. Curl. Got curtains. Yeah, no, there's a No. Yeah. Oh, lots of bad. <laughs> Any others here? I have 16. Oh, there's like the. We need to start. Yeah. It's the, it's it's the slide left. Left. Oh, um, is there like a white one? Oh, like what's the page? Page. Oh, page yeah. girl. Oh, what's the. There's a one that says swipe. Sorry, I'm missing. Pinwheels. I think that's Star. Fall off. Flips, clocks, pinwheel, slide right, go to the left, curtains, shatter, white, curl, cube, drop, book, genie. Flip. Promethean person. Doubles. Doubles. Fade. Swing. Okay, we ready? Looks like it's star for no homework tonight. Oh, big one too. Tough proofs to do as well. This would be big. All right, everyone's now looking now, huh? Star it is. Ready? Yeah. 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 Let's go! Bang out! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> we gotta finish the notes, but after we're done with the notes, I guess there's no Wait, more. Does that mean it's like you never do, or we just do it there after? No, not do it. Don't do it. Do it. You can do it if you want to. There's right? literally no homework. Yeah. That's the way that the rules are. We play with fire with that game. There's no way. Yeah, like, on this yeah. the hardest to work. Oh. Okay. No problem. <laughs> All right, here we go. We move on. We still got two more to do, though. One congruent to two. I'm already rattled. I hope you don't get it again all year. So bitter. <laughs> Okay, here we go. 
No problem. <laughs> uh, right off the bat, uh, looks like, where are we going? QET and QEU. Got to prove those triangles. What already ha What's already given to you? A pair of angles, right? A pair of angles in angles three and four, so I can put an A next to those. And also, I heard a couple of people already chime in. What can I count already? Test. QE, QE equal to itself. Yep. Uh, so there's another pair of angles or sides. Sorry. Anything else you can think you can get as a third pair, right? Because two out of the three come pretty quickly. Usually the third pairs are a problem. Is there anything we can get right now? Right now. Don't try to get ahead of me here. Is there anything right now you could tell me is true on those two triangles? Another pair of sides or angles? Anything. What do you think, Tiffany? Oh, I don't want. I don't want to go to another two pair yet. Is that what you're saying? I want to stay where where we are in those two triangles before I give up. Before I give up and look at another pair of triangles, I want to focus on the two we need to prove congruent. Are there any other sides or angles that I'm not seeing? Before I give up and go to another pair of triangles, and I say give up, we're not giving up. We'll be back to them. Uh, real quickly, and this has been a common mistake through all my geom and geometry classes, and I want you to tell me why I'm wrong. Can I say TE equals EU because congruent sides are across from congruent angles? No. Those angles are congruent, so sides TE and EU must be congruent. Isn't that what that theorem says? Yes, no? No, no why not? Those two angles have to be in the same triangle, and they are not. So I cannot say TE and EU. So are we all in agreement? I have nothing here now. Nothing. So let's give up on those two. And now let's search for another pair of triangles so maybe I can use their corresponding parts. Does anybody see any other triangles? I know Tiffany has already said it, but any other triangles up here? Go ahead, Sophie. QTB and QUB. QTB and QUB will be congruent, but not until I tell you, because I only have two pairs of angles. I need something else to finish it. QB equal to itself. Everyone yes, QB. Uh, I'm just... If you want to make that step three, you can. I'm just going to fit it in step two because it's still reflexive. All right, I need that. Now we have, yes, triangle TQB congruent to triangle. If I go TQB, I got to go UQB. What's our method there? Yeah, angle side angle that reflexive side is in between angles one and three and two and four again why do we pair, prove another pair congruent so we can steal some of their a pair of their corresponding parts that are also in here and that's you and your partner's job right now where are those corresponding parts in the angle side angle triangles that are also shared in the triangles we need to prove congruent okay let's talk it over with each other here where are they no, that, so now we have this and Anybody find them? We find them here? Theodore, what'd you have? Uh, TQ is congruent to UQ. Correct. TQ and QU. Correct. So TQ congruent to QU. CPCTC. That does give me a, another pair of sides. Perfect. Now I just completed it. 
So now we can say triangle QET, congruent to triangle QEU. I just need a method. Method, Kira? Side angle side. Side angle side. Good. Five steps doesn't look intimidating, but that was the whole key to the proof, right? Trying to find those pair back proof of another pair. All good. All right, you guys have one more on your own here. It's two part. It's two parts. Make sure you prove the triangles congruent first, and then try to get part B or the next part. I'll let you guys have enough time as you need. Uh, I'm, don't call me over if you're done. We'll go over this one together in a little bit. I'm assuming getting the triangles is not too bad. But just that next part. Maybe we can there. I saw some triangles. And that gives us angle N. And then go to the other one. Oh, wait. But no, let's do that. Right? No. Or no, it's 
Wait. Yeah. Triangles are like um, triangle, A, B, D, and then go. Yeah, and then Yeah, Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, you no, know, these triangles are isosceles because um, AC gets bisected and B, 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 we grew to each other. We have sides. Wait. Nothing tells us that. Oh, wait. Yeah, so first you just have to say the triangle of the DT. Yeah, that's yeah. And then you can just say C. Yeah, so. Uh, so want to go? You still want to talk, or we want to talk about this as a group here? All right, let's come back together here. First, before we start anything, are we all in agreement? We can all get the triangles congruent, side angle side. Yeah. Everyone saw the vertical angles, even though there's E, G, F going right through it. Yeah. Everyone saw those were vertical. Are we all on this step? Yep. D, G, C, B, G, A, before I get to how to prove G, E, and G, F. All right, now let's go. We've, we've said all unit long, I am not going to get G, E congruent to G, F unless the triangles that contain them are congruent. So we have, we have a choice right now. I'll make it, though. There's actually two sets of triangles that contain GE and GF. We could go those two triangles congruent, and then say CPCTC. Or it could be the other pair, GAF with GCE. I could prove those. Well, Mr. Carleon, why aren't you? Why don't you just want to go that one with that one? Uh, I don't have any information. Those sides aren't equal. I'd rather already start with a pair of sides than with nothing. True. All right. So let me go. I'll go to my first pair that I had. So I'm going to try, or you're going to help me try to get ang triangle DGE congruent with GFB. Because if I can do that. GE and GF will be congruent by CPCTC. Guys, I already have a pair of sides down, right? I already have a pair of sides. Anything you see in there? I have another pair of vertical angles there. Okay. So I'll put angle DGE congruent to angle DGE and FGB. Vertical angles are congruent. And yes, you could put that in with your other set of vertical angles if you wanted to, but you know how I roll. I always like them separated. Okay, all right. Hey, hey. I got a pair of sides and I have a pair of angles. I need one more pair. And this is where I think some of you might have struggled. Can we remind ourselves that these two triangles are already congruent, meaning any of their parts are as well? Any parts coming from the side angle side triangles that might help me in uh, the ones I'm trying to prove here, Bennett? Uh, angle, D, angle, B. angle D and B. All right, aren't those in the big ones we just proved? And they're in the ones uh, I'm trying to prove right now. All right, if, if you're going to do the other two, I do angle C and angle A instead. All right, it would be angle C and angle A instead. So yes, angle D congruent to angle B. CPCTC. And now I have enough information to prove those two red ones congruent. 
triangle DGE, congruent to triangle BGF. What's my method for those two then? Angle side angle. And now you can say G and GF. Woohoo! Please just keep in mind when we're doing these proofs, once you prove a pair of triangles congruent, you have a lot of power. All the other parts are now if you ever need any of them. Okay, so once you prove a pair of triangles congruent in a proof, very powerful statement because now all their parts are congruent if you ever need any of them. All right, again, I made this deal with you first day of school. We're not, uh, there's no homework, but the answer key is still up on classroom if anybody decides to, to try any of them out at any point. Okay, but I will not be checking that tomorrow. That is totally your call. Uh, tomorrow, we're reviewing. We have a rare, because of the way the three-day weekend fell and where our test falls, we have a rare two-day review. Friday, Tuesday, and then Wednesday's the test because we're not in school on Monday. Yeah. We're not yeah. Veterans Day. So we're not in school on Monday. So we will review Friday, tomorrow, and Tuesday when we get back. And then Wednesday is your test. So the rare two-day review. Mm -hmm.